Hello, Sergio. Hey, Bob. What's this? This just happens to me. A new Godox SL150 light that LPM has just bought for the studio, for members, and the public to use. Oh, neat. Let's go ahead and open it up. Yeah, let's unbox this sucker. Okay. This is the second episode of our new series, LPM Unboxing. Yes. And, and we don't box, technically. We don't box. No. We unbox. Uh, this thing is definitely hefty. Yeah. I would probably say 10 pounds, maybe. Oh, I don't know. What do you think? Five pounds? Oh, well, it is. Ten heavy. pounds? Yeah, maybe six, seven pounds. Yeah. So you want to put this on a pretty sturdy stand. Okay, packaging. Okay, did it come like this, or have you, did you cheat and pre-open? Oh, no. Oh, maybe we did. I think you cheated. Oh, yeah, no. there would have been styrofoam <laughs> on top. We Go somehow ahead. cheated. I apologize. You we apologize. cheated, not me. All right, so there's the instruction book. Okay. And inside, oh, man, this thing is solid. Check that out. Oh, wow. Yeah. And it comes with a reflector, and, oh, that looks like so a pretty... this is the light right here. Yeah. So this thing moves. It's got it's a yoke. A yoke? Yeah, it's a good yoke. And it's got what is this? FX GR channel and a fan? Yes, okay, so the FX this thing will do a couple special effects. It'll flicker uh, like fire. Really? I think there's a TV emulation mode, you know, like the TV in the room. Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh you know, it's it's very solid. I mean, there's oh yeah, no it, rattle in this. Is that plastic or metal? I think it's polycarbonate, but it's yeah, it's very solid. Huh. And this is metal, the yoke. And uh, oh yeah, that moves really well. Wow, tightens easy. So the nice thing about these Godoxes is you can control them through a uh, remote control. Uh -huh. So they also gave us a pretty. That's a pretty lengthy. Power strip, power power cable. Yeah, that's heavy duty too. And oops, they uh, also give us one of these Godox RCA6 remote controls. So what's really cool about with those? no batteries in? No, come on, you've got to buy your own batteries. No, some, come no. on, Godox, give us some batteries. So uh, another neat thing about these lights is you can group them. You could have. I can't remember what the amount of lights you can control with the remote. Mm -hmm. You change the channel. Okay. Each light is assigned a channel. Yeah. And then you can uh, adjust the, the the level of light up or yeah. down. And that's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. It huh. is pretty cool. So if you're hanging your lights from a grid like that, yeah, yeah. you can just control. Yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Huh. Now, unfortunately, it doesn't have DMX. Uh, now I have one of these, and the fan is very quiet. You can actually run this thing in uh, non-fan mode. Really? But it dims it down 50%. Okay. Now, I'm not a big fan of these reflectors. And why not? Uh, well, they're pretty harsh. So. Oh, another thing to show you is uh, this is a Bowens mount, S mount. So uh, all you do is slide this tab back. Oh, and there you go. There wow. is the light. Okay. That's heavy duty. Wow. Yeah. So then we want to, we'll just slip this on for the sake of demo. Yeah, it's a nice, you know, it's a nice package. All right. All right, so here Point goes. It in. Ooh. That's a lot of light. So. So the 150 stands for what? 150, 150 watts. watts. That's so LED watts. LED watts. So if you... So this is now at 100%. Obviously, we're now Blasting blinding lights. all of you. Yeah. We apologize for that. But it, it's... it's oh, oh. Oh. oh, okay. So I'm going to turn the light all the way down. Okay. And I'm going to light you with the rim of light. And uh, it's nice. Hmm. It's not a bad light. It's a good light. Yeah. And I it's like with the fan light. on. Or off. The fan is on right now. Okay. Yes. Really? It's yeah, yeah, really yeah. quiet. It's very quiet. It's yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. And wow. we're at we're at 5% power now. So, okay, so this is 5%. Wow. <laughs> That's 100%. It's it's a it's So a, shine it maybe on me. What, no, what is that? I'm going to blow the, close your eyes, buddy. Uh, Woo. Uh, wowza. Yeah. I can definitely feel that heat. Yeah. 
Now, uh, this wow. is 5600K. It's balanced okay. for daylight. Okay. One of the disadvantages might be that uh, you can't dial in other Kelvin settings. Other oh, so you can't do that? No, no, so no. So it's set to It's 5, set to 5600. Okay. Now, they do make what they call the uh, one SL150 by which is the bi diode. It has gotcha. the uh, tungsten and the daylight. Okay. And I do have one of those. Yeah. Uh, and it's 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 a nice light. You know, it's great. Uh, you know, if I were doing a three light shoot, mm -hmm. I might want uh, two one fifties, and then uh, you know maybe that three hundred that we're going to unpack or two hundred that we're going to unpack shortly. That's yeah. that's a buy. Okay. So you know maybe you have for next episode. Yes. Back for episode three. Yes. You've got another light. Yes. Okay. Well, that was great. Yeah. Any Thanks. other, anything else you want to say about the light? Or? No, I like them. <laughs> well, there you go. No, you I mean, for to... the money. Yeah. You know, I, I can't no, say I, they could do better. Yeah. I mean, I think they're great. I yeah. Mean, they, yeah. Good, good light output. Mm -hmm. They're affordable. Mm -hmm. um, and there's so many modifiers you can put on yeah. these things. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Thanks. Thanks all of you for watching. If you want to come and uh, try these lights out for your set, uh, your TV show, or, or you know, rent it out for home, uh, for your studio home or something, come on by at Longmont Public Media here in downtown Longmont. Uh, we'd love to show you how to use the light. Um, and yeah, just come on and check us out, and we will catch you guys on the flip time. side. On the flip side. On the flip side. On the bright side. On the bright side. <laughs> <laughs> All right.